Brother Fabian, why are you like this? Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry for everything. Why? Why should you carry all the body alone? Who am I supposed to carry the burdens with? It is my responsibility to keep an eye, to feed, to watch over my siblings. Just look at it. Up till now, you haven't eaten why? Because I haven't provided. And there is no food in this house. Brother, it's not your fault. Why do you keep punishing yourself by taking the blames? It is my responsibility. It is my duty to keep an eye, to provide for all my siblings. You think I'll be happy? Think it's possible for me to be alright? Don't worry. Money will come. Okay? When? When is this money going to come? Remember, Mom used to tell us to pray when we are down. I never. I never say to pray. Keep praying. Then you'll see what God can do. Just go inside the kitchen and see if there's anything you can lay your hands on. If there's anything you can prepare, just... Oh, um, Mommy, Ma, is she open? Yes, 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 she open. Okay, just go there. Kalai said she should give you anything you want, anything enough for you to cook. Oh? I'll tell her by month end, I'll... I'll sort all my debt. Oh? Thank you. Yeah, one alone. Please clean your tears, okay? And, brother, what about you? Hmm? Are you not going to eat anything? When will you change? Meaning? Meaning this was the position you were before I left for work with same 90 on. This guy has been making my day. He's such a cool guy. <sighs> Emilia, use your head. How? <laughs> this guy has been chatting with you since the morning before I left for work and returning back from work with same guy on the phone. Isn't it obvious he's totally jobless? Billion, come off that stone age mentality that you have. You don't need to leave the house before you can work. Technology has made it very easy for you to work from home. Do you even know if he has boys working for him? <sighs> you always have something to say. You always have excuses. See, I don't even have time to argue with you. What did you cook? Nothing. I ate noodles all day. As usual, Madam Phone. Just get to the kitchen and cook yourself food. Work up. If 
Fine girl. Oh, finally, you're going out today. So who's this lucky guy? Sorry to bust your bubble. I am not going out. I don't understand. Emilia, are you actually wearing this heavy makeup on just to sit at home? I am expecting a visitor. I knew it. You knew what? Listen, it's no one else but a professional photographer. I need to take professional pictures so I can feed my Instagram accounts, my TikTok, Facebook, my social media accounts. I know, all the accounts. Anyways, I have good news. Samuel has finally proposed. Mm -mm. Far from it. Listen, my company has started recruiting and I have slot for one. I think you should just apply. Who knows, you might end up working in the same company with me. <laughs> Fillion, look, a woman is not supposed to work. All right? I just want to look good and survive. A woman is supposed to just look beautiful and survive. That's all. Emilia, survive on a man's pocket. Is that what you call a job? Let me educate you a bit. A woman is created to relax and enjoy. A woman is not supposed to stress herself at all. All right? You know what? You can give this letter to someone else. I am not interested. Anyways, how much for a start? 100k, babes. That's huge for a start. <laughs> oh. <laughs> 100 what? Fillion, please don't choke me with laughter. You call that money 100k? Really? <laughs> well, there's dignity in labor. And I would advise, take up this job. And at least at the end of every month, you're sure of a certain amount. Oh, Fillion, please just stop talking. All right? Allow me to concentrate on my makeup before my photographer arrives. Jeez. Eat the makeup if you want. 100k. <laughs> Wait, it seems Philia doesn't even know who she's staying with. I can't even tolerate the attitude of the public. I cannot deal with their body odor, bad breath, and all that. The company cannot even afford me. I am too expensive. Oh. <laughs> My name is Amelia. A graduate from Oxford University, England. A master degree holder from Cambridge University. You know what they say, that what a man can do, a woman can do better. It's my pleasure meeting you. Have a nice day, darling. <laughs> what? Why are you looking at me that way? Amelia. Don't you think it's better to live an upright life than in lies and deceit? Fillion. Life is not upright, my dear. Truthful people don't succeed. Men love lies. Lies sells faster. At least people who live upright life get help more than those who think they've made it. I beg, change topic. I tell you how they find help. Who needs help? The truth is bitter, yet admirable. Filia, hmm. you and I know that the truth is not admirable. Nobody is truthful. Even your leaders, they are not truthful. Because if they were truthful, they will not deceive us. Okay, for instance, before election, they mount the podium. Read the manifesto like 8 o'clock news. Make all sort of promises. Deceive the public. By the time they become leaders, they forget the promises they have made to people. So you see, Nobody is sincere. Is that why you scam people? <laughs> My dear, everybody now scammers. Old, young, even in your company where you work, there is one particular person that is always milking the company. So you see, nobody is a saint. <laughs> well, there is dignity in labor and not in lies. Hey, see me see Now your dignity, now your lies. <laughs> My dear, as long as we live on that same roof, I will always tell you the truth. Who died long ago? Ask your politicians. Oh. Filian! 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 Yes! Come and see, come and see. What is it? Look at this cute, handsome man. 
They are swimming in cash. Is that why you called me? And who told you they have money? Have you met them one on one? What kind of question are you asking? Don't you have eyes? Eh? Men looking at these men, you know they are capable. Emilia, it's not everything you see online you believe. I know it's not everything you see online you believe. But see this guy now. The guy again, again. see his skin. Eh? He looks like someone that just returned from a summer holiday in Bahamas. Look at him. Okay. Look at him properly. I hear. He can get Abby. Why not choose him and settle with him? Since he can get. Wait, did you just say settle? I thought you said they find him when I won't marry. Mm -hmm. Emilia, you know you're always lucky with rich men. What I'm saying is, why not choose one from them if it is him? I see Genge. Choose him and settle with him. Really, and it's money I want. I don't want love. Love doesn't exist. Love is a setback. As a matter of fact, it makes you not to achieve things you set for yourself to achieve. Mm. I don't get time for love. Oh. Mm. So you want to be jumping from one man to another? You're not afraid of all these sicknesses flying around? Afraid of what? Condom no day. Hi. Hey, Emilia. what's smelling? Hey! My noodles! What is this? What is what? Emilia, what is the time? 8 a.m. And a responsible man is in front of her phone twerking on social media. I mean, this is totally disgusting. Philia, we have been living in this house together for a while now. By now, you should understand my kind of person. And is your kind of person worthy to be emulated? Hey! I beg anybody to emulate me. How does my life affect anyone? This is my office, so I don't beg anybody. I they live my life like this. Oh, you call twerking on social media an office? This is where I fit from now. I cannot be a slave with monthly wages. It's not possible. You know, fear happen. Really? Well, I'm not trying to run your life for you, but I think your lifestyle needs to be displayed on a visual device so you can see yourself how disgusting your lifestyle has been. I think that is an insult to my profession. Oh, you call social media hooking a pro? Ma madam, madam, I beg. Start going. You're already running late. Since you started poking your nose into my affairs, all you do is go late to work. You better go there before they fire you. Run now. Of course, I'll go to work because I have work. Sit down here and be twerking on social media. Please, I'm off. Every time you're always off. That's why you don't get money. No sense. No, don't jump when you get money. What is it? What's pushing me? Can I have your attention for a while? Um, there's this big fish I met at the gym center. He's very cute. Okay, uh, as usual. Um, when is Samuel coming? I don't understand. What, uh, what concerns Samuel with this whole thing? Um, this guy and I started talking and I told him that I'm a social engineer. Emilia, social what? Engineer. Well, you have still not answered my question. What has Samuel got to do with your crush, Miss Social Engineer? Um, this cutie and I fixed the dates. Well, you haven't still answered my question. You know, as a social engineer, I'm mm. supposed to, you know, appear gorgeous, neat, classy. 
You're right. At least you need um, to look good to cover up your lies, right? And now you're talking. Yeah, so how do you intend to do that? Uh, <clears throat> That's why I'm asking after Samuel. I want to see if I can borrow his car for a date. I don't want to go there appearing like a gold digger or looking like a cheap, low lift person. <laughs> Emilia, you are already a gold digger. Wait, wait, did you say you want to borrow someone's car? Yes. <laughs> Baby, you, you, you drink Como, you, you drink gas. See, don't even say it for the second time to my hearing. It was you who decided to live a fake life. So you should be prepared to foot the expenses that comes with it. Don't disturb me. I have something to do. I, I, I have work. If you don't have work, as usual, go upstairs. Go and continue twerking. I want to my work. I want to bring on to borrow someone's car. <laughs> Now that you're here, what are we going to have for lunch? I don't know. I don't know how bust up you are. I don't have anything on me. So what do we do now? Because I'm hungry. We have no choice. You just have to go to... Mama, you might again. No, we have no choice. We still have to go back to Mama. I'm about to give you whatever it is. I know. Listen, listen. Go meet Mami Ma. Huh? Go tell her that I said she should give you things to cook with and later I'll balance up. It's as simple as that. But brother, for how long are we going to continue taking things from Mami Ma? Listen, it's not a good time to talk about how long. It will end soon. Huh? Just go to her. Tell her I said she should give you things. So, you know, let's just go. Before month end now, I've sorted the bills. And what if she stops giving us? God forbid. She can't stop giving us now. She's my friend. She knows. Uh, those times where I used to have. I, I, I do bless her now. Now that I don't have, she should be there for us. So I just tell her what I said she'll give you. See, brother, I sat down. I've calculated the money we are owing now. It's 25,000 Naira. 25 what? Yes, 25,000 Naira. Twenty-five thousand. Has he got into that? I'm. Oh goodness. I'm not going there again. Well, um, we still have to fall back to her. She's the only one who can give us for credit. Please. Huh? Please, go to her. Tell her what I said. Go. Huh? Tell her before months end, I'll, 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 I'll pay up. Ah, brother, for how long are we going to continue like this? What if the man has no money to run the shop? Or what if she chooses a day to embarrass us? If you went shopping without me, you, you should have just waited till we can we'll do it together. I'm sorry, it was urgent. I couldn't wait. It's fine. So, who's the big fish this time around? Nobody. Mm -mm, mm -mm. Emilia, I know you more than anybody. I'm serious, nobody. Look, I need to go shopping so I can impress this guy. What guy? I can't remember anybody. The guy I told you about. The guy I met at the gym center, Sophilian. I took my time to check this guy's profile and assets. This guy is hecking rich. He's stunningly rich. That's why I went shopping, so I can meet his requirements. 
And what requirements are you talking about? To be able to catch a monkey, you have to act like one. At the end of the day, I am hoping to, to get a whooping sum of three million from him. <laughs> Please, Amelia, stop daydreaming. Monkey catcher. Fillion, I am sure of this dating. Just help me convince someone so he can lend me his mm -mm, car. Mm -mm. Please, I beg you with everything you represent or serve. Don't tell me that. I'll give you a hundred thousand naira if you can help me convince someone. Please. <laughs> Darling, you're so hilarious. So how are you? Have you eaten today? Honestly, I cannot wait to go on the Dubai trip with you. That's why I needed to see you. All right, love. Have a nice day. <laughs> I love you too. Bye. Emilia, Wait. I throw a cap for you. What did happen? You shock you. You don't need to appear like a gold digger. So what's up? Have you been able to convince him? Who? Oh. Samuel, of course. See, listen, Emilia. Any man who truly loves you would appreciate the rags you're wearing instead of the gold that will fade off someday. I know that's not what you really preach. Is it now a crime to appear good when you're going out on a date? My dear, you're not trying to appear good. You're trying to look rich. You want to impress. But it's the same thing. First impression matters a lot. I bet tell me about Samuel, Joe. Do you want to hear about Samuel? Yeah. Well, I haven't told him and I don't intend telling him. But wait, how do you intend to sustain the impression you created at first sight? I don't understand what you did, yeah, You don't forget me again. What's there to cover up now? Oh, but Emilia, wait, let me let me ask you. What's well, it be Samuel's car? So you know get anybody where you feel borrow car from. All those your friends, those your Wakadube friends. You don't feel borrow cars from them. Which kind of friend you be, Seb? You don't just stress me for this car matter. I don't want to chop the car. I borrow the borrow the car and I'll put fuel. I don't understand you. Hmm. Give me this car if you want to give me now. Emilia. Zukwanike. Zukwanike. Anyways, make I help your life. I get solution. You, you, you want car? I get solution. What's the solution? Yeah, Go ahead. Brother, mm -hmm. I've been wondering about our situation. And it seems you've lost faith in prayers. Isn't it too early for all this? I know, but I, I had a dream. A dream? And it's about you. I dreamed me and my mom was screaming and shouting by your owner along the street. Uh, okay, okay, okay. Listen, I understand your plight. I know why you're worried. You're disturbed because of the debt, the accumulated debt we have with Mamima. But I thought you want then it will be sorted out. Take your mind off it. Despite the fact that it is a dream, I'm still not comfortable. Let's stop buying things on credit for more, please. And eat what? I have an idea. Let's call Mama and tell her about our situation. Maybe she can just get us food stuff on the She's village. just going to shut up. That's gonna tell Mama again that easy. Do you know Mama has BP? Do you want her to die? Mama, Do you know how she will feel if she finds out that I'm not broke? Mama will not die. Just keep the pride. In fact, I'll be the one to go to the village. I can even help out with family so that we can put food on our table. And you listen to me, kid. I still remain the hell of this house. And I tell you to stay put. No one will be hungry in this house. It's only a matter of time. Everything will be fine. Then just get ready for us to die in Hong Kong. Because I see it's coming.
Yeah, back so early. Reggie, I'm tired. What's up? So, who owns you today? My Mr. Handsome. Who is Mr. Handsome? Ah, uh, Fillion. How can you forget so quickly? The guy I met at the gym center. Oh, 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 I remember him. So, what's up with him? Well, today is the deal day. We're having a date <laughs> today. Today is my cash out day. Babes, I will be coming home with plenty of money. In fact, I will have to open bank with CBN. After CBN, it will be World Bank because the money will be too much for CBN. I'm thinking maybe I should come with a bullion van to help me carry the money. Because the money will be too plenty. Oh. My guy is so rich. Huh. Ah! Just be ready, Sha. <laughs> <laughs> Emilia, do not count your cheeks until they are hatched. Anyway, what did you what did you make? Uh, anything in the house? I made yam and egg sauce. I prepared it specially for you because I'm in a happy mood. Hey! This one, we have to go and give testimony. My sister, go and enjoy yourself. <laughs> My friend, don't worry. That's your dream of becoming a billionaire. And <laughs> some hours will come to pass. Amen. No. <laughs> See, babes, I'm, I'm so famished. Let me go and eat. My sister, ah, enjoy. Ah. Babes, how do I look? Babe, I think you're the reason James Blunt sang You're Beautiful. Because you look so breathtaking. Thank you. You look classy. Thank you. And sexy. Thank you. Amazing. Easy with a flat tray. So my man can complete the remaining finishing touches, please. Mm. We that we don't have man. <laughs> anyway, where is this love zone? Westgate restaurants and gardens. Babe, that's where you're going to. Mm -hmm. Babe, that place is a place that all these rich dudes with heavy pockets go to. And that's where our politicians hang out and lavish our national treasures. You can say that again. Now you know why I needed to look like a politician's daughter. I see, babe. I concur. I see. It's becoming clearer to you, right? Yes, it is. It is, babes. Anyways, I'm late. I'll see you when I come. Go and have fun, babe. Thank you. Ah, is this my friend? Will this get hot? Ah. Hmm, hmm. Hmm. trying to do a first time introduction. Oh. Hi. Wow. <laughs> you look so beautiful. Thank you. <laughs> oh, no, no, no. Come on, Emilia. That looks too cheap and local. How can I behave as if I'm from the West? Remember that you're a big girl who is planning a trip to Dubai. When I get there, should I hug him fully? Emmy, think of your code of conduct. Hello? I'm at Opposite Westgate Gardens. Where are you? You're on the street behind Westgate Gardens? Okay, you see me shortly. I thought our meeting should be exactly at Westgate, where I can have a taste of foreign delicacies, hot and tasty wine at least. Well, Probably where he's asking me might be 100% better than Westgate. Madam, we 
are we going to? Oh, please just go turn. Go to the street behind this Westgate Garden Hotel. Okay, this street. Yes. Alright. Let's go, please. I'm here. I should come in. Okay. You know, immediately I saw that jeep parked outside, I knew it was your car. Yeah, my car. What happened to your car? Oh. Since you came with a car. That's actually one of my many cars. Oh, really? <laughs> yes. So what's the money for? I saw you paying the driver. I was just tipping my driver. That's what I do all the time. Don't you tip yes? <laughs> I see it. Thank you. <laughs> oh. Ah. Actually, let me introduce myself. My name is... Uh, Rani. I cannot forget that in a hurry. Anyways, my name is Amelia, but my friends call me Amy. Yeah. So, yeah. Rani, we were supposed to meet at Westgate Gardens. What happened? Oh, very sorry. Actually, Westgate is used as a landmark to direct strangers to this place. Okay. I see. That... Is that your car? Where are they taking it to? I told my driver to go and wash it and fix itself up with some food. Oh, wow. It means you're a very generous person. I mean, you take care of your workers. That's what I do. To fix himself some food. That's what I do. I take care of them. That's nice. Excuse me. Um, waiter, come. Sir. Get us um, two bottles of Coke and a plate of pepper soup. Okay, sir. Excuse me. Come with two spoons. All right. Okay, Ma. What would you like to have? Are you okay? Is something wrong with you upstairs? Mm -hmm. I just said two bottles of Coke and a plate of pepper soup. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry, sir. Please correct yourself. Ah, sorry about that. Emilia, there is trouble. But I thought is. Hurry up! Waiter! Chai, is this what I spent money in going shopping for? How do I tell feeling that I don't have the hope of coming with a bullion van again? God will punish you for making me spend a lot just to see you.
Ah, man, there's pepper in this one. Ah, the pepper in this thing is too much. Eh? Can I? Ah, thank you very much. A good person. Ah. So, my dear, when are you going to Dubai? Sorry, excuse me, I have a call. Oh. Um. Yes? Oh, my goodness, are you serious? I... Thank you, thank you. I have to go now, there's an emergency. So soon? Yes. Oh, thank right. you for everything. I face this bad mouth of a girl. <sighs> what lie do I fabricate to cover up this shame? Okay, I'll I'll tell her I cancelled my date, so I can plan for my trip to Dubai. Yes, that will work. Ha, Emilia, you are a genius. Auto and finisher of my soul. Please surprise me. Surprise me. Surprise me. Even if it's a contract of 500,000 for. It will be enough for me to clear up all my debt. Father Lord, I pray that this moment that you're hearing my voice, my cry, that let a contract come to me in Jesus' name. Amen. Simon, how long have you been here? Not quite long, Faria. My mom, please. Oh, Stop is... doing this to yourself. Oh. Simon, Simon, how do you expect me to stop? Huh? I'm not asking for too much. 500,000 Naira contract. It's more than enough for me. Look at me. You know me in and out. I'm starving. Huh? Um, Fabian, I know. I know all this. Oh, even if it's a contract of 500,000, I would still appreciate it. I mean, look at me. I cannot be crawling like a snake. I have submitted quotations from different places. None seem to have answered. No one has called me and said, let us work. Easy, man. Easy. Just take it easy. Yes, it's a to... gradual process. What hmm? gradual process, Simon? What grows it until I start having grey hair? What are you talking about? I just saw Team Construction Company, their vehicle was making supply. Am I not supposed to do that supply? Is it not my turn to supply? What is going on? Fabian, that means it wasn't meant to be yours in the first place. So let it go. When will my time come, Simon? Huh? How long, Simon? How long am I going to wait? When is my time ever going to come? Look at me, I can't even walk around my neighborhood. I'm owing almost everybody. I'm owing Papa, Mama, Mama, Mama. I'm owing Mama Chikodi. I'm owing Papa, Papa Chinaka. I can't even move around without people pointing at In fact, my nickname is now a debt. Enough, man. Enough, enough. My guy, listen. You have to calm your nerves. Hmm? What is yours would definitely come back to you. 
Please. When is my time ever going to come, Simon? What's going on? You complain so much. I complain so much. I complain so much. It's not until I grow grey hair. Please stop it, stop it. Please. I don't like it. I don't like it. This is the shortest date I've ever seen in my entire life. What happened now? I was expecting a bullion van to see you off today as well. There is no police to escort the bullion van. What, what thing happened? Can you just stop, please? Hey! How, how, how can I stop when you gave me hopes of going to make it? <laughs> please explain to me what really happened. I didn't want to appear as a gold digger, so. I had to dress very well so as to suit his class and personality. So, I called off the date. Uh, I needed time to prepare for my trip to Dubai. So, I called off the date. I told him that when I come back, I'll see him. <laughs> Emmy, Emmy. <laughs> I know you very well, Lou. Emmy, I know you very well. Look into my eyes and tell me you called off that date. After all the whole Sengemege, the whole ceremony you displayed here. Huh? Tell me, I'll be your babe. Talk to me. What really understand. happened? What really happened? I said I called off the date. Do you have a problem with that? No. Oh. But Emilia, I have lived with you in this house for so many years now. Do you remember I'm your best friend? I know you very well, so you can talk to me. Hmm? Look at your eyes. It's written all over your eyes. Tell me now, what's up? I'll be your babe. Chist me. Oh, he didn't, uh, he wasn't up to what you expected. Tell me now, I'll be your babe. Yes. If uh, that guy is a gold digger, he's a bigger one than myself. Do you know that the guy did not take me to the West Gate that he promised? He took me to one local restaurant. Ah, huh. Emilia don't suffer. The idiot bought me a plate of pepper soup and two bottles of coke. <laughs> when he finished drinking his own. The pepper in this thing is too much. Huh? Eh? Can I? Ah, thank you very much. You're a good person. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> but <laughs> Emilia, wait. So how would you have paid me the hundred thousand naira you promised? Thank God you did not listen to me. My sister, I was so ashamed of myself. You should be. Hi! <laughs> I felt disgraced. <laughs> Do you know even the so-called Jeep that that he claimed belongs to him that was parked outside? Uh. Somebody has drove the Jeep. <laughs> The idiot still had the mouth to tell me that the person is his driver. It's I never knew that men can lie, you. Hey! This one pass me, yo. This one, I be the main gold digger. He did gold, pass me. No, gold digger, jam gold. Go, go to dig the digger. You know, the one where they pay me, money when I say buy these clothes, even this one, they my body, and I get the money. Packaging go wrong. I borrow, I borrow the money. Hey, packaging go wrong. <laughs> Welcome, babe. It's more funny. Stop laughing. Ah, man, don't laugh. I'm gonna laugh for because I tell you. <laughs> Emilia. Hey, brother. This is rice. This is yam, and this is noodles. What? What did you tell our mother that made her go through extra miles to gather this up? I told my mom nothing but the truth. We are suffering. You told our mother we are suffering? Aren't we? There's nothing to pretend about. Simon, are you seeing what my sister is doing? Fabian. 
What is your problem? Few minutes ago, you were busy praying, asking God to bless you, to supply your needs. And probably this is the answer to all your prayers. So why are you complaining? Yes. This is the answer to my prayer. Have you seen what you've cost? At the detriment of my mother, at the expense of my mother? Fabian, there is nothing like stress here. No one is stressing your mother. No woman in her right senses will see her children suffering or die and fold her hands to wash. Never. That is not the sign of a good mother. So your mother did what she has to do. Eheo, if I forget. This is the money Mama said that she gave to me. Ten thousand. Pleasure to meet you, sir. Today, um, I'll check my schedule to know if I'm free. I'm actually a very busy person. Yeah. Okay. It will be nice to finally meet you. Have a nice day. <laughs> I heard you on the phone. Who was that? A friend. Emilia, a friend that has no name. Emilia, you're not tired. Why don't you just stop having dates with different people? Did your experience with the fitness guy hasn't taught you any lesson yet? <sighs> Philia. Ma? Have you ever thought to rest from work? Why should I? That's where I earn my living from. Same here. When business flapped with a customer, it doesn't mean all the customers are of the same fate. If you don't win, you keep trying till you win again. That's how the game works. That's when it's business. Emilia, this is not business. I can see you're still adamant about my warnings. I hope it pays you big with this hope of becoming a millionaire with it. You're raising your voice. It's just the both of us. I know. Phila, don't you think you're late for work? Ah, Emilia, you're so annoying. Have a great day with your calls, businesswoman. I'm already having a nice day. Have a nice day. day. Far away is thy king. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth. Far away is thy king. Ale, ale, ale. Brother, why? Why? Huh? Kid, why? Why? Get out of here. Far away is the. Mm, thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth. Uh, 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 uh. Okay. All right. Thank you. Far away is the key. Ale, ale. Take this to few tears of me. Ale, ale. Ale, ale, ale! Leave me alone! What is this? Stop it! Leave me alone! Leave me alone! Leave me alone! Stop it! Leave me alone! Stop it! Yeah. What is the problem? So, 
your mother gave you her hard earned money and all you could do was to use that money to buy what will send you to hell? Fabian, what has come over you? What is wrong with you, Simon? Well, Simon, what is it? My anger is that you should have used the money to pay people we are owing than to lavish it on alcohol. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Give me my drink. Let me drink my sorrows away. Fabian. Sir? Do you know sorrow itself swims? Swim. Do you know you are gradually swimming into depression? Why? You are very correct. I am depressed. Depression is my name right now. Look at me. Just take a very good look at me, Simon. I cannot foot any bills. Look at me. I am I am owing everywhere. I cannot even survive without you or my mother. Fabian, I am not complaining. I know how you used to spend on me before you were deported. I know how you used to buy my ticket when I was in Czech Republic. Fabian, for the fact you are no longer doing those things doesn't mean you will not do them again. I am not complaining. Good times will soon come back. Uh, please. Can I ask you one question? Simon, all of those things that you, you just mentioned, can I, can I do any of them now? Can I, can I do one of them now? I hit it when you Stop it! Stop it! Oh. 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 Please talk to him. He's my only brother. Fabian, you will still do that. But first, you have to stop your habit of drinking. Because it is not good for your head. And secondly, as someone who is expecting God to bless him and change his ways, you don't expect God to bless you while you are drinking always. You have to stop this drinking habit, if not for anything, for the sake of your health. Okay. Pastor! Say the word! Pastor! Go ahead, preach! Or should I say doctor? No! Doctor, Pastor, Simon. Just let me drink my sorrows away. Huh? Just let me. Oh, Fabian. Sir? Be calm. God himself might purposely allow all this to happen for people to see you and glorify his name. Uh, and at the end, everything will to his glory. Uh, Please. Okay. The blessing of the latter shall be greater than that of the former. Yeah. For the Egyptians you see today, you shall see them no more. The Egyptians we see today, we shall do what? You shall see them. You are not talking, kid. Don't you go to church? We see them no what? Uh -huh. When will that happen? Very soon. Very soon. Very soon. God uh -huh. has a way of doing his things. When I'm Even if he allows you to suffer today, he has a reason for it. Good. Very soon, all this suffering shall turn to a miracle to others. Uh -huh. Shall become a testimony. Uh -huh. I've known my friends for many years. I never knew he was a pastor. Say the word, Pastor Simon. Fabian. Do you? Fabian. Do you? Fabian. No, you don't know. Please. Simon. <coughs> Do you know what it means when you eat like a king and all of a sudden you now eat like a servant? Not even servant. Servant is a lot better because servant and wages, the end salaries, they have income. I do not have income. I do not have anything. And I have my drink, my blessings. Oh, Fabian, my blessing. Oh, listen, all oh, this is just a test for the moment. Okay. You oh. have to pass through this. Okay. It's okay. Okay. Are you done, Pastor? Are you done, Pastor? Wow. Ouch! 
Chief. You must be Amelia. Yes, Chief. Oh, Chief, you smell so good. This must be some ninety girl mixed with some Dior and Elizabeth Eden. <laughs> I love your colon. Thank you. I'm Amelia, and you must be Chief Kayede. Yes. I must say that your intelligence online is not different from what I am seeing here. And I would say your hospitality came rather so quickly than you promised. Any apology for that? Oh, I'm sorry. I was in one of the suits trying to put one of the things together. Okay. So, shall we go inside? Um, Chief, I, I love respect and dignity. I hope to be with you soon as well. I think it's better we get to know ourselves before anything can happen. Oh, it's all right. I am not in a hurry to have you. Please, let's see now. Thank you. <clears throat> so, can we get to know each other? Yes, please. I'm Emilia, mm. first daughter of Chief Barrister Wilfred. My parents live abroad, but why I and my sibling will live here in Nigeria. I'm a petrochemical engineer. I am currently working with Shell. Oh, I must say that you are a self made millionaire. <laughs> you can say that again, Chief, but that doesn't mean I cannot welcome kind gestures. Mm. <laughs> like they say, the world is never enough. Oh, sure. Well, I am Chief Kayode, the High Chief of Oshobo in the state. I am into general merchandising as we do everything that comes our way because there's money in everything. Including banditry? Ah. <laughs> <laughs> you can't be serious. Of course I'm not. It's all right. Um, I think it would be nice if I have your account details about your sister. I would like to do you a huge favor. Wow, that, that would be nice, Chief. Thank you so much. Uh, my pleasure. Wow. So, how is your family? Oh, it will be preposterous to say that I am not married. Of course, I am married. But my family lives in the UK. Oh, okay. So, how are you coping with the stress, considering your status? Oh, well, I have employees that take care of my needs. Oh, nice. <laughs> oh, please, forgive my manners. I didn't offer you anything. What can I offer you, please? Uh, champagne? If you're not working at the office, you're working in the house. Rest now. My dear, I have to. This is where I earn my living. Babe, you look so happy. What's up? Just me now. I am happy, you, my sister. You know that guy I was talking with on the phone earlier on? The guy is very rich. You know that place, that useless room he could not take me to? That West Gate? The man took me there. If you see the place, very fine. In fact, that place is like heaven. It's, it's for rich people. Hi, I wish I saw Rooney. I wish Rooney saw me entering that place. So he will know that places I can enter, he cannot enter that place in his entire life. <laughs> Babe, can you just forget about this guy? 
From the way you're speaking about that man that took you to Westgate, I'm very sure that Pepe Rest. Correct Pepe Rest, babe. The guy will You need to see his wristwatch, his car, his colon. Everything about this man smells money. See, his perfume is something out of this world. I have never used that kind of perfume before. You might go find joy. Hi. Um, that's fine, but from the description you gave, he must be a married man. He's married, but his family is not in the country, his family is in the UK. Oh, lucky you then. <laughs> You're welcome. I hope you brought some goodies for me. My sister, which one be goodies? The money when this man send enter my Aza, he better pass goodies. That's nice. Well, I made some food in the kitchen, so just go freshen up and eat something. I'm not interested. Just give me my make I take step down. <laughs> ah. So because Pepe don't rest now, you don't they send me message. Make I help you carry your bag, go inside the room too. <laughs> no, no, no. All right, let me say it right. I love you. Ah, that one. She's here. <laughs> she give her the phone. Hello, Auntie. I'm fine, thank you. And you? <laughs> Someone is missing you here. <laughs> When are you coming over so I can get to see your face? Okay. All right. Bye. Hey, baby. All right. <laughs> Just ignore her. It's all right, babe. Um, I'll call you later. Bye. you mean by <coughs> no nothing i just need water that better be nothing so you can go inside and have water so did you get the money simon can you can we stop petting words can you stop making it look like it's not what it is you and I know that you can't keep encouraging me to keep patching like this. Can't you see that God has forsaken me? Oh, stop it. Stop it, Fabian. God can never forsake his children. Oh, no matter what. Take a good look at me. What other evidence do you need that God has forsaken me? Bro, this is life. We all go through trials. How long? Simon. How long? How long will how long will I continue to live in penury? Just look at me. This is the fifth year since I got back into this country and nothing to show for it. Life was even better when I was still abroad before I got deported. Oh, Fabian, stop saying this. God can choose to bless you anytime, anywhere, and wherever he wants. Remember he's God. God. Why have you forsaken me? Isn't it time for you to bless me? Fabian, the ways of man is different from the way of God. That is the word of God. And the same word of God said that ask, and he shall be given unto you. Seek, and you shall find. Knock, and the door will be open. I have been knocking, Simon. Fabian, keep knocking. God will definitely open the door for you. That reminds me. What about your girlfriend, the one you have been dating online? Hmm? Which one? I can, can recall. I mean the marine engineer lady. Oh. Hmm? We've been talking for a while now. So how is it going between both of you? Fine. Don't you think um, this is the best time for you to open up to her? You never can tell. 
she might be the one that will help you out of your difficult situation. Simon, did you just, did you just say that? Well, wait a minute, Simon. You want me to start asking her for help? Hold on, Simon, come on. Oh. My relationship with this person is online. Just friendly relationships, social media relationship, and that's it. How do you expect me to start relating my problems with her? Oh, she should start carrying my burdens? Is that, is, is, is that what you want? Is that, is that what you expect? Fabian, can you just drop your ego? Do not allow your heart to play a prank on you. That lady might be the solution to all these problems. Listen, that cave you are scared of entering might be where the source of a treasure is since these past five years. Simon, are you aware that this woman might look down on me? As a matter of fact, she sees me as a big boy. How can I condescend so low as to tell her that... No. No. Just give it a try. Talk to her first. Simon. Goodness. Goodness, Simon. Simon, I haven't even set eyes on this woman. We haven't sat down to talk heart to heart. And yet, you want me to look at her in the face and tell her my problems. Really? How do you think she'll see me? Little boy? Beggar? Chicago? Is it? Fabian, pride goes before that fall. Someone, you can't tell me to try her first. The only time one can expose such problem is when we have heart to heart talk. I mean, if we know each other in person, not a social media relationship. Fabian, there is no error in trying. not sleeping and please could you reduce the volume of your message tone and or your phone tone please it's really disturbing me i'm in my office but it's late that's when my head will become to rake in millions into my account besides this is the right serene environment to chat my lovers <laughs> let me call this my contractor boyfriend who has been looking for excuses not to fix a date for me but you'll be asleep by now. Don't disturb the poor boy. Who told you he's poor? In fact, I'm going to arouse him tonight so he can have every reason to, to see me. Let me chat him. Let me send him sexy pictures. Emilia, were you not the one who told me that you transferred some millions into your account? So why hunting for another so soon? Make I ask you one question. Money de belefu. Unless you want more salary and resign now. I think I call my boyfriend a bit. Please just reduce the volume of your message. Don't know your phone. I just want to see if you want to see. Good evening, baby. How are you? Hi, babe. How are you? I'm fine. I'm surprised you remembered me today. I should be the one telling you that. Actually, I have been a bit busy, you know. I have things to do, just trying to get my company to the permanent site. Don't worry about that. I'll help you. Baby, I... I really want to see you. My body, soul, spirit longs to see you. How is my baby girl? She's fine, and... You talking about soulmate, this, that... Are you pulling my legs? Sweetheart, how can you say I'm pulling your legs? Sweetheart, you stole my heart with your sweet words. Now you're here telling me that I'm trying to pull your legs. Were you joking when you said you loved me? No, I'm not. It's just that, uh... I never believed that my words could count a man. 
How was I supposed to now be able to woo such a beautiful girl like you? What are we saying? I'll die if I don't set my eyes on you. You made me fall for you. Now you're here acting all surprised about me being your woman. You're getting me all confused. I am not. I'm not confusing you, babe. I love you and you know it. It's just, uh, just give me a little time. Everything will be right. Little time like? Mm, let's just say two weeks. Two weeks will be enough to put myself together. Okay, my Prince Charming. I just thought I should hear your sweet, lovely voice before going to bed. It's all right, darling. Have a lovely night rest, my Prince Charming. My regards to your sister. Good night. Love you. I love you too. Could she be the Messiah Tadius was talking about? Oh boy, think. Think. Don't watch this one, babe. Hey. Another Magaludi. Let me quickly call my boyfriend. Babe, you did lie. In fact, you should be the next Nollywood star. I don't understand. Why would you suggest me to become a Nollywood actress? I tell you, so I won't act. Because you acted so well. Even me sitting right beside you almost fell for your lines. That's the job. I wonder what will happen if he realizes you're not for real. Babes, only poor men go after women that deceive them. The rich men move on. And if he refuses, that's his cup of tea. Do <sighs> you know what? Emilia, please, could you just go downstairs and stop disturbing my sleep? I want to sleep. Better. Let me quickly go and continue my walk downstairs. Ugh. Ah, uh, 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 and of course for me. There you go. This is how I've always wanted you to be. Cheerful. <laughs> Fabian, you look bright. All thanks to God. You see, I've been calling you Pastor Simon. It should actually be Prophet Simon. <laughs> Why did you say that? Because after you spoke to me yesterday, unexpectedly, she called. I mean, my marine engineer girlfriend. <laughs> she called and she sounded like she missed me. That means you told her about it? Nope. Why? Because... We, I mean, it's rather too soon. Since we already have a date and then we meet very soon, it would only be proper if I exchange these words or if I tell her face to face. That is a good idea. Oh, yes. Very good one. So when? Um, I told her two weeks. Two weeks? Yeah, because I... Why? Um, two weeks because uh, I made her feel um, I'm busy. Don't you think that is too long, considering the breakthrough we are expecting? No, come on, Simon. You are good at some part, I'm good at the other part. You know, these things, we take it one step at a time. If you rush, you crash. So we take it easy, one step at a time. From her tone, she sounded like she wanted to help me acquire the land. Talk more of when we see. She will do everything. <laughs> That is a nice idea. <laughs> nice idea. Of course. In that case, it's really a cause to celebrate. What are we waiting for? <sighs> to greatness. To higher level. <laughs> higher level. I'm so happy for you. Sorry. Sorry. Oh. Hello? Good, good day, sir. Ah, well, I'm fine, sir. And you? At your office? Right now? Oh, I 
yes sir all right sir right right away right away i'll be there shortly thank you sir thank you sir god bless you sir god bless you sir thank you sir thank you sir how was that ah ceo global pleasure flex he wants me to see him at his office right now why <laughs> What is wrong? What do you mean? Why? I submitted my quotation to his company wow. and he's calling now, I guess. That means that has to be in the that position. What? Do you have to worry along the minute. You kidding in me? Are you kidding in me? <laughs> Greatness. To higher level. Higher level. Higher level. I think I need to change. I told you that God answers prayers. I told you. God doesn't just answer prayer. He wins. He wins. <laughs> Oh, wow, look at my man. One second. Look at Tanya. One second. <laughs> One second to greatness. Higher level. Yeah, Fabian. I have gone through your documents. And uh, I am satisfied with them. Thank you, sir. Thank we will you, award sir. you the contract. <gasps> Thank you, sir. Thank you, thank yes. you very much. God bless you, sir. Yes. Thank you, sir. <laughs> Two million for a start. So, 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 so what, what happened to my document? You just said you confirmed that they are all right. Where is the two million coming from? We discussed 20 million. And the moment you told me about this business, I had already made calls. What will I tell my business partners? Please, sir. Please, huh? please. But what will I tell my business partners? Please. All right, let it not look like I am not grateful for them. For this offer, but can we make it five million, please? Please. Are you taking it or not? Thank you, sir. All right. Um. You sign here for me, and um, you also sign here. That is for your own copy, and then you sign here, and also here. You're welcome. One more thing. Yes, sir. My company is known for quality. Do not supply us with substandard materials. It's Friday. You can start on Tuesday. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Fabian. Sir. When next you have a business appointment, do not drink. So how did you go? How is this supposed to go? This is the reason I didn't get what I'm supposed to get. How? How has my dream got to be the reason why you didn't get your drink? Drink? Oh, come on, Simon. Have you forgotten what happened on that day? I was drinking. My whole mouth was oozing of alcohol. And so? What's wrong about it? What is wrong about doing business for 20 million now with someone on the first day when his mouth is oozing of alcohol? Wait, 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 wait. Does it mean that they don't drink or smoke in their company or what? Are you just going to listen to me, Simon? Because you're, you're just thinking, I don't know if this beer is the reason you're not thinking straight. 
you are having a business proposal with someone and on the first day his mouth is oozing of alcohol are you going to do business with that person what 20 million naira tell me bro are you saying he gave you two million to come back for the remaining 18 million or what i got two million uh, then you, you, it's still okay it's still very much okay that two million naira is like an access for you getting the remaining 18 million isn't it do you understand exactly where my point is that alcohol, alcohol is the reason I didn't get 20 million naira. But to worsen the whole thing, I I got there late. But you left immediately, he called you. Traffic. Traffic. As a matter of fact, we met on the road. Is that come on man? Come on. Come on. Listen. Um my man, look, listen, listen. You went for a deal. What 20, 20 million? million. You got two million, and you are assured that if you do well with the two million, you come back for the remaining eighteen million. So why are you worried? Chill. You may not get it today, but you will definitely get it tomorrow. So chill. All you have to do is to execute the two million dollar very well. Then the eighteen million is to be yours. Hmm? What do you to worry about? Come on, relax. What do you want? What do you want? Alcohol again. You not serious. Philip, I need to have a word with you. Sit down. Is, is anything the matter? What's the problem? A lot. How can you be so hardened not to share your burden with me? Uh, Emilia, do I look like something is bothering me? Nothing is bothering me. I'm totally fine. There you go again. If you cannot share your secrets with me, who else are you going to share it with? Amelia, you're still beating around the bush. What is the problem? I'm okay, and you know I'm not hiding anything from you. I'm totally okay. Indeed, you are hard not to crack. Did you not get an alert of 400,000 Naira? You knew? Why won't I know? You call me your best friend, yet you cannot share your secrets with me. It's obvious you have been bothered about this money. It's written all over you, but you don't know how to let me know. I know you better than yourself. Why would you keep such a secret from me? I expected you to let me know. Okay, so, so how did you get to know about it? I made Chief Coyote transfer that amount of money to you. He asked me if I had siblings. I told him I had just you. So he requested for your details. In my presence, he wired 400,000 Naira to you. I expected you to tell me. I am your best friend. Okay, I'm sorry. I just, I just wanted to confirm the source before I could tell you. Yes, I knew you were going to ask me to withdraw it and keep, but I was just trying to weigh the um, possibility of being traced. And I'm sorry. But who is Chief Coyote? You can have the money. It's yours. I will tell you who he is later. Oh, babe, that money is huge. 400,000 Naira. What job did I do? Filian, you should be appreciative. I also got 600,000 Naira. Are you serious? So, what did you tell him that made him release such amount of money? <laughs> you sound as if one millionaire living chief's account is all that he's got. He has trillions of that amount of money in his account, so he is not bothered. Oh, he's such a generous man, if it's like that too. <laughs> yes. <laughs> um, during our conversation, he talked about building 
an orphanage home for St. Stephen Church. Oh, that's so nice of him. Mm. Mm. He's a nice man. Yes. God will bless him. Yes, he will. I need to call my boyfriend quickly. So, which one? The general contractor I told you about, we're having a date tomorrow. Da da da. Da da da. Fabian, don't tell me honestly how do I look? Where are you going dressed like someone who just got a waiter job in an expensive hotel? Dressed like a waiter who just got a job in an expensive hotel? I'm going to change. No, come on, come on, come on. That's not what I mean. That's not what I mean. I mean, you look cool. I do? So tell me, where are you going to? I have a date with Cindy. Cindy? Yes, Cindy. Who is Cindy? Simon. The girl I've been telling you about. Oh, you mean the marine engineering lady? Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. And today, I am going to scoop her honey pot. And you know what that means? I am going to scoop her. She might get pregnant. How? Well, she sounded like one who is in a heat period. You know how they sound when they're in a heat period. Oh, can I see you? I miss you. I miss you. And then you know that's the time to hit. <laughs> Mr. Man. Yes. Don't be too sure, my man. And if I should suggest to you, take my advice. Do not go there until you execute that contract. Oh, please, Simon. <laughs> you keep sounding like a pastor. Listen. I've mapped out this whole thing. I mean, I have it all planned out. I'm not even going to spend up to 200,000, which is your job. Listen, I have this all planned out. For every 2 million naira, I stand a chance to gain 500,000. Now, you multiply 500,000 times 9 through the calculation. <laughs> Mr. Bond. Yes. The law of prudence says do not always. Count your cheeks before they are harsh. Bros listing. A bed at hand. What's two in the bush? Now let me quickly tell you something, Simon. One of the law of smart people, great people. You make hay while the sun shine. Now that she is in her heat period, we move. We hit. I have warned you. Do not go until you execute that contract. That is my word to you. Do not go. Good for that's the bad rubbish. We move. And how much is this one? Oh, this one is 800. What about this? You're a customer now, so I'll just give you this one. 100k. This is lovely. Yeah, how much is this? This one is 600. Mm. 600? Yeah. I'd like to have this one. Okay. Madam, please, like with this cost, do not disappoint me. You don't have any problem at all. Sorry, excuse I, me. It's okay. Hey, baby. Oh, yeah, I just want to let you know I'm on my way. I'm ready. I'm at the salon. Oh, ba baby, you can't be at the salon. Come on, man, we have a date. I know. I just thought I should do one or two things to my hair. You know, but I'll be done before you know it. I suggest we leave from here though. So I should come over to the salon, is that what you mean? Yes. That's if you will not be inconvenienced by lots of females around here. Okay, okay. How can you say things like that? You, you already know I don't get distracted like the girls. Come on, man. You're the best. Alright. Alright, 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 alright. Uh, heading straight to you. I'll see you soon. I love you. Love you too. Bye. Madam, please quickly, we are making this hair. Okay, show of hands. Oh, look at you. <laughs> How are you? I'm pretty good. Okay, I'll it. Of course not. 
trust me. Okay. Emilia, where will you take this mogu to? I hope you are buoyant enough to spend today. You don't die today for my hand. Should be you get money where you won't spend. You see these ties? You know go into them. Lie, lie. You will see hell today. Ma, you're good to go. Okay, how much is everything? 600,000. All right, give me your POS. I'll just quickly use my ATM card. All right. Now. <laughs> Madam, sorry, I forgot my ATM card. Okay, you can do transfer. I don't have the app on my phone. You go from your husband. But he is not. Uh, uh, to pay, right? Oh, come on, do not, you do not embarrass my woman like that. How much is the money? $200, Only? All right, hold on. Um, which bank? So we are going to your house? What for? So you could change. That won't be necessary. All right, I'm already dressed. We can just go to a very nice hotel so I can quickly have you in my arms. Like I told you on the phone, I cannot wait to have you in my arms. I knew you were ovulating and I won't miss the chance of making you the mother of my kids. That's the best way to get you hooked. So, um, where are you taking us to? I am the boss here. I just take you to a serene environment where we can have the opportunity to pour out our hearts and then make love. I totally agree with you, but I think it is a bit raw, or should I say, too straight to the point. <laughs> Fabian, true love doesn't know how to fake it. You just have to be real. At the same time, I think I should be saying the things that you just said and not the other way around. But you didn't say it, so I thought I should help you out. Come on, start a car, let's go. We're running late. Baby, are you okay? Yes, I am. No, you don't look okay to me. Are you sure? Yes. I'm good. Stop, stop, stop! What? I just saw something. Just back over here. Um, how much is this? Sure, I like it. That's five thousand. Let me have it. Okay. Um, how much is this? That's seventy-five. Chicken change. Bring it. Uh, darling, are you okay? Yes, I'm very okay. So, is your AC on? Yes. You sure? Yes, it's working. Ah, is it? Uh, is that the highest? Yes. Okay, uh, baby. I don't know. Something is just. I just need to be in the car. Let me just pull off. Baby, that won't be necessary, all right? Just stay by me. Let's shop together. We're not spending the time in here, all right? Okay. Um, how much is that shoe? Oh, this is yeah. this is five thousand. Let me have it. Uh, uh, babe, babe, uh, the car price isn't. You just let me have it. Don't they price here? But listen, I'm a big girl. I do price. Just package everything for oh, me. Okay. okay. Why do you like this? How much is that? She did not. Included. She did not. How much is everything? 980,000. Only? Okay. okay. Darling. Hmm? Can you quickly help me transfer 980,000 naira to her? Today? Yes, now. Now? Yes, now. Oh, goodness. I just wish I could do this big transfer thing. Call the account number for him. Zero zero. Mm.
I'm finished. We haven't even gone out on a date and the money is finished. How do I tell her now? Baby, what's wrong? Are you okay? Yes. Of course I'm fine. No, you're not. You look disturbed to me. Do I? Yes. <laughs> of course I'm fine. Listen, if we are going to do this, you need to be transparent for me. So what's wrong? I don't even know how to say it. I feel, I feel so dark away. But since you've said if we must do this, we have got to be transparent between each other. I, I just try as much as I can to open this little. You see, um, I didn't know we will go through all this process. I mean, I didn't really bargain for it. I, I asked my accountant to fit just two million into the account I make transfer with, and then. I didn't know we spend much. I would have asked her to pull like six, seven million, you know? And now bank time is over. I don't even know what to do. I've been trying her line. It's not connecting. I don't know what to do. You know, my kind of person is not really good calling others money. I'm a big boy. And now I'm just thinking of the um, where I'm going to find money or how I'm going to find money for us to go out uh, since we're going out on a date. And that's just why I have this mood swing. Is that why you look like one with money? Mm. Don't worry. We'll go to my house, I'll get my ATM card, and I'll refund every single money that you've spent today. No, no. C come on, sweetheart. I mean, when you say I refund... I am not complaining. Let me do my thing. Start the car, let's go. Your stuff. Yes. Oh. Yeah. I mean, these things are too much. I can't help. It's fine by me. I'll just quickly go into the house and come out with my ATM card. All right? All right. <laughs> are you still sure you don't want me to help you? It's fine. Trust me. All right, let's go. My love, you, you can come in now. All right? I My siblings are in there. I really want them to see you now. You know, we just met. When the right time comes, they'll see you. All right? It's one step at a time. Take care of you. I'll be back shortly. Now. I'll be now. waiting. All right. Are you sure you don't want me to help? I'm fine. You? Trust me. Those things look heavy. Be holding this guy so for 30 minutes. What is happening? I just don't know how long. Oh, goodness.
please. Oga, you've been standing here for long. After dropping a lady with bags, hope oh, there is no problem. Uh, actually, there's a problem. You see, I, I dropped my, my, my woman here, you know. Uh, yeah, she was just supposed to go upstairs, freshen up, and then she comes down so that we could go out. But this is two hours. Uh, yes, two hours. I, I haven't heard from her, Not, neither has she called me. Okay, have you called her on phone? Her phone is switched off. I've been trying it. I don't even know. I've never been here ah. before, so I wouldn't know where oh, she lives. God. Okay, do you know the flash she leaves? Goodness. I don't know. Actually, this is my first time meeting her. She said I should drop her here. She only wants to go up to freshen up chain so that we can go out for our, our date. And then this is it. It's been two hours. I haven't set eyes on her. I'm worried. Okay. But I haven't seen such a person on these streets before. Maybe you might have met her too. Beg your pardon? No, no, sir. In as much as I'm asking you for help, you, you can't call my woman a dupe. What is that? Uh, listen, she, she cannot possibly be a dupe. I mean, I, I, she's responsible. She has a saloon. She just says she wants to go up. So I'm sure she lives here. Okay, Maybe... let me answer. Hey, everybody, excuse me. Did you see a lady standing here with bass a few hours ago? Yes, she's beautiful. Yes, she's beautiful. Tall, Tall. Slim. Yes. Yes, I saw her stopping Keke. Where is she? The gate. Stopping what? She was stopping Keke and she was carrying some. She was carrying something with Keke. No, she passed her compound and tried to have there's a road at the back. Yeah. I, 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 you're sure you saw her? I, I just try. She's slim, tall, beautiful, you know? She was carrying a bag. Olga, huh? you better leave here. You better leave here before these boys will notice you are here and you know what they will do to you now. Goodness, goodness. Hey! Goodness. That just won me. That just won me. That just that you fucking won me! Two million. Two million. Where do I get this? 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 That just won me! That just won me! She could be a scum. She is a scum! Goodness! It is quite expensive to take me out on a date, baby. I'm an expensive chick. Wait. You mean you were packing and he was looking at you? Before Uncle, that's the power of a woman. The poor boy must be in pains. Ah, that won't consign him. I don't send a message, not being a defined woman. But I mean, this is quite very unfair of you. Oh, life itself is unfair. But wait, wait, though. As I'm looking at all these items, I think they are worth almost a millionaire. What are you talking about? Just this hair on me alone is about 600,000 bucks. Are you serious? Yeah. And this is the pack? That's in Vogue hair, baby. I see packaging now. So everything you see in here is equivalent to 2 million. Are you serious? That's what I'm talking I about. I think he has money now. What are we not talking about? Which money? Someone that was crying that all the money he spent was the last cowboy he had in his account. And I'll keep telling you, you know, this is not fair. This is, this is very wrong. <laughs> enough, please, enough of this preaching. Let tomorrow come. I cannot wait to rock my outfits. Yo, baby. Enjoy. <laughs> ah. Look at what you have done to yourself. You wanted to feast on her, and now she ended up feasting on you. What a shame! Simon, Simon, please, 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 please. If you look at me very well, you see I am disturbed, I am perturbed. Please, just give me time, let me sort myself out. Let me solve this problem myself. I talked to you in the low tone, but you wouldn't listen. 
Honestly, if you were a kid, I would have flogged the hell out of you. What are you waiting for? Why would I act like a child? Huh? Just look at me, look at me. Look at, look at the kind of mess I have put myself into. Big time. Big time mess, man. Before now, you were complaining about the lack of funds. Suddenly, you got two million naira. What did you do with it? You lavished it. Now tell me, how do we pay back this money? How do we pay back? If I had known. If I had known. I want you. I want you to postpone the dates. But you refuse. Now look at it. The worst thing is that she has blocked me everywhere on social media. What's up? Instagram? Everywhere. I don't even know where to reach her. Where? Where do I find her? Oh, you expect someone who has duped you to continue interacting with you? Who does that? And Chief will have every curse to believe that I am serious. I am nothing but a drunk. Of course, you have just justified his doubt of seeing you as a good for nothing fellow. That money was like a bet. But you refused to say reasons with me. Sure, we'll not report this lady to the police. Um, um, mm, mm. Okay, please, please, please. I'm not getting the police involved. Why? Why? You know, it takes money to involve the police in this country. Will you foot the bill? No answer, no. Will you foot the bill? I believe that is the case. My darling. <laughs> I have good news for you. My God. Good afternoon, Kate. How are you? Cheer up. I said I have good news for you. Listen, 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 son. If you look at me very well, you see I'm not in a good mood. Please, if you have anything important or reasonable to say, just spill. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. Our guy is back. You see, it's back. <laughs> which which of you say? Uh, uh, Fabian, I don't want to say in this. Oh, you see now, Chicharito Seven is back. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Wait Chicharito, Chicharito is a town. Chicharito Seven. He's back! I'm telling you. <laughs> <laughs> Did you see him? Yeah. No, 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 no. I bumped into a Gladiator. Huh? And he told me that Chicharito is back. Wow. If that. Wow. If I let me just tell you. Mm. He's not just back. He said, if you see the convoy following his car, you will know that the guy is made. The <laughs> guy is made! So he now moves with convoy. I said my business. So how is that going to help me out of the problem that I find myself in? Baby, what are you saying? What are you saying? Have you forgotten how close we were with Charito back then in school? Now that our guy is back and fully loaded, don't you think that this is an opportunity to kick into the money and collect our own share? He is throwing a big party. And guess what? We are both invited. 
That is the first and the starting point. I have been calling you since morning, but you are not picking. Um, um yes, boss. I'm, I'm fine. It's just that I, I'm in the market, so I did, I didn't hear the phone ring. I'm sorry, sir. Okay, meaning that you, we are doing the market survey. Yes, sir. In other words, we shall be seeing you at the factory tomorrow. Yes, sir. That's a good one. See you tomorrow at the factory. All right, sir. Okay, bye. you are doing the wadua what's going on welcome hey, what's why are you smiling what's the excitement about mm. babes i met an old friend he invited me for a party babes this party will be attended by top dignitaries people that matters in the society well that's good and i hope you find one who holds your heart there Babes, must you talk about something without mentioning love? It's love by force. Every day, party here, party there. Don't you get tired? My love, life is meant to be enjoyed. Anyways, you are coming with me and no excuses because it's on a weekend. If it's Friday, yes. Saturday, no. What if it falls on Saturday? Then I won't go. Why? Because the next day is church. Oh, holier than thou. Anyways, it's on Friday. No excuses from you. Fine then, but on one condition. Which is? We won't get back too late. Sure. You were good. Babes, this gown that you are mending, don't you think you should dispose it? Dispose waiting. Something that I bought with my hard earned money. Oh, because you don't know how it feels to walk out and buy something. Please, leave it. This gown, never doing work finish. Must the gown be very old before you dispose it? Oh, please, Amelia, just leave me. Leave me now, nah. rich woman. Please, go inside and eat something. I know you'll be hungry. You see me, I can never amend any of my wares. It's not possible. I know. If they are old, I throw it away and get a new one. I know. Mm. What did you cook? Go in there and check for yourself. Mm. Welcome.
this boy had better not play games with me because I show no mercy. I knew there was something wrong with him, but I decided to give him the benefit of the doubt. Now look at him. Because of just two million naira, he is switching off his phone. <laughs> Fabian, you can run, but you cannot hide. I will definitely catch you. By the time I am done with you, you will not know what hit you. He came with money, I told you. He came with money. Big body. So much money. See, money so much money. Like money is the root of all. Evil. Look at this guy. Look at Chikarito. But I told you this guy will change. Oh no, he's spraying, he's spraying money again. He will change your difficult situation to enjoy. I told you. to the driver, but you won't tell me you don't know why that man was calling us thieves at the party. I'm sorry for the embarrassment. That was Fabian. Fabian? And who is Fabian? The guy I duped that wanted to sleep with me. Oh, Emilia, I've told you several times. I've told you what goes around comes around. You just, you, you just need to be careful. Uh, God help you one day you don't meet somebody that will embarrass and disgrace you in public. Oh, for people thing. That's if only you forbid Enough, me. I beg. Enough? I mean, is that what you're saying? If they had caught us out there, you would be telling me it's enough? I don't blame you. It's me that followed you out that I blame.
Good morning, sir. Good morning, sir. You! What is it? So you don't bring men to my house? You have no fear! Mr. Fabian! Ah! Ah! You are needed at the station for questioning. Is it not? My friend, move. Move. Huh? Move. Officer, what is, what is the problem? Sir. Sir. Move. Huh? I said move! Officer. No, man. Sir. Sir. Move! Sir. 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 Kids, but why didn't you call to inform us that the police were here? I did not know when they came in. And before I realized, they've already broke in. And they asked me not to make any call. So, I was afraid they could harm me. It's alright, son. Your brother will be fine. It's alright. So, Simon, where are they taking my brother to? Don't worry. Hmm? I want you to make me one promise. That you will not call your mother over this. Only if you be of help. Sure, we. Then fine. I won't call her. Let's go inside. looking for global flesh productions limited number 34 kingsway avenue I'm coming, I'm coming. Hey! Who are you looking for? Uh, good Come morning, here. sir. Good morning, sir. I ask you again, who are you looking for? It's you I'm looking for, sir. So, how may I help you? Um, sir, uh, I, I came in respect of uh, that my friend that was uh, arrested. Oh! Oh, oh, oh. So you are a friend to that criminal? Uh, yes, sir. Uh, no, sir. No, sir. No, sir. But, but, sir, he's not a criminal. He was duped. So what are you doing here? Or do you want to join him in the cell? No, no, no sir. No, sir. 
I, I came to plead, uh, to plead with you to please please him. And what happens to my money? Listen, that young man will rot in the cell unless he returns my money. Or oh, do you have it? Uh, no, sir. But, but sir, uh, keeping him in the cell will do him no good. Please, sir, uh, uh, release him. Will you keep quiet and stop disturbing my peace? Okay, sir. Okay, sir. Uh, okay, can you just release him? Uh, let me sign an, an, an undertaking. If after two months he didn't pay, then you can throw both of us to, to jail. Abu, come and throw this man out. Uh, sir. sir. How did it go? It went well. Look at your eyes. You've been crying. I hope you did not tell Mama. No, she didn't. She made the promise not to. In that case, you you have Simon here to thank for everything. You call first a marine engineer. Yeah, doesn't pay. Don't forget, don't forget that the wages of sin is death. Simon, I I cannot. Thank you enough for all you've been doing for me. Especially since our things became a bit difficult. Once again, I, I thank you enough. I can't thank you enough for, for bringing me out of this dungeon. Thank you. Don't be too excited, Fabian. Because we still have so many rivers to cross. The question now is, how do we raise two million naira in two months? Two million naira. Confused. Don't be confused, my brother. You are the one that got us to this mess. So think. I think I just need little time to put myself together. Time is no longer our friends at the moment. I think I have an idea. But it's going to cost money. I hope it's something that will bring us returns. Maybe. Maybe not. We just have to try. How much are we looking at here? Hundred thousand naira. In that case, I have to sell my car. I will not advise you to sell your car for now. Maybe I will bring that hundred thousand naira from my account. Then, after that, if it doesn't work out, then selling Africa will be the last option. What? What will I have done without you, Simon? What? The rate at which you stick by my side, most times when I have problems, is something I cannot get on. But all the same. What are friends for? It's nothing. Thank you. Yes! 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 Yes!
What is it now? You almost scared me. Remember that business I told you about? What business is that? That's online networking that looks like Ponzi scheme. Oh, yes, I remember. I just received 200k for putting in 100k in three days. See? That's good news. And I am told that if I put in 5 million, I'll get 10 million. Mm -mm. See my armpit. No hairs. I don't subscribe to that. Don't even try it. Babe, see? People are giving testimonies. Ah! Where has this platform been? Oh! Hey! But that's not you risking your life savings. I don't, I don't subscribe to that, babe. I suggest you manage what you've been given. Do you remember MMM? Babes, life is all about risk. <coughs> and not this kind of risk. Risking all your life savings. Babe, my hand no deal. Look, you cannot discourage me. Because people are giving testimonies, healthy testimonies for that matter. Look at Pastor Levi of God Living Church. He's also involved in this. He has given his own testimony. You're here wasting time. <coughs> Amelia, I have advised you the way a sister would advise a sister. If you like, Listen, if you like, don't listen. Now you, Sabi, yo. Make I go look for five million, no. Oh. No! If I put in five million, I'll get ten million. I'm gone. Look for ten million. Greedy woman, then. Now here I go, then you come meet me. Can you log in as Pastor Levi? Well, I just did. And I've also shared my testimonies. Good. All we need now is the agreement. I think I should just um, log out Pastor Levi and then use Pastor Moses. Yes, he will be a better option. He's well respected. And whatever he says, he does. Do you have his pictures? Mm -hmm. Yes, I do. I just have to upload from my phone and then um, send it right here. Good. Just have to make them believe. Share testimonies. But... Are you sure this is going to work? Fabian, trust yourself. Trust in God. I don't understand what is going on. What is going on where? I can't find the app. What app? The online platform I told you about is no longer available. <laughs> well, whether available or not, you've gotten your own fair share. You don't understand. No! They have closed. So you don't owe them and they don't owe you? You say? Hey! How do I find them? Oh, how do I find them? How do you find who? Wait, Amelia, don't tell me you did another transaction with them. I... I you what? I invested five million naira. Five what? Five what? <sighs> Amelia, I can't believe you, you, you turned deaf ears to my warnings. Eh? How can a full grown smart woman fall for such cheap trick? Amelia, five million naira is not a joke. What do I do? My money. My money. Thank you for your patronage. Hey! Who is sending you that? I'm finished. Who sent you that? The guy has windowed. The guy that chased us out of the party. He's responsible for this. I'm finished, oh! That's very stupid. My money. And he won't go scot free. I'm calling the my police. Money's... No, there's no need. I'll handle it my way. Emilia, you handle it your way. So you're just going to let five million naira go just like I'm that. I'm not letting it go. I'll handle it my way. Ha! That's what you always say. At the end of the day, you fall mugu. You will handle it your way. Wow! Yes! 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 yes. Five four million 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 naira. <laughs> Look at the five million confirmation. 
Confirmation. Confirmation. Honestly, you are a genius. No wonder your name is one of those disciples in the Bible. You mean you're a genius? I told you. Five million naira. What do I do with this? I told what you. What do I do with this? I told you it's going to work. What do I do with I told you. You know, what, you know what? You know what? What? You know what? Well, tell me the kind of business. Let's call Chief Kyle there and tell him we're bringing back his two million naira tomorrow. Then we'll share the remaining one. Let's go. Chief Kyle, of course. That is not going to be possible. That's not going to work. Why? What do you mean, why? Five million naira? Listen, that idiot has the guts to arrest me, put me in the dungeon, me, Fabian. All because of how much? How much? I have five million naira. You want me to give him two million naira for us to share? 1.5? That's not going to happen. Okay. No, that's never going oh, to happen. Uh, uh, Fabian, Fabian, are, are you okay? Are you alright? You have been praying and asking God to bless you all this while, and all of a sudden, He gives you 5 million naira, and you're here thinking of something else? What has come over you? I'll tell you what has come over me. God is a good businessman. That's why you see everything He did went well. He did everything day one, day two, day three. He didn't flop until the seventh day He rested. I'm a good businessman with five million naira. That is my capital. I will be giving him the gain from that capital, not the capital. This is crazy. This is crazy. Are you okay? I can't be okay for five million naira. You know what to do. I'm going upstairs to freshen up. Make me as mentors bar. What did I say? Mentors bar. Do not forget, mentors bar. Mentos! You keep being like this. I'm, not, I'm still waiting. Waiting for what? You promised to tell me who the generous man that sent us money is. What money? Money that has been duped alongside my other savings. Do you know, I've been thinking, I'm, I'm, I've been careful not to partake in the national loot. EFCC might be after him, and when traces of, of transfers will be made. Our accounts will now be found amongst the accounts that received money from him. Babes, come off it. Chief is not a politician. Neither is he into fraudulent activities. Babe, how do you know him by meeting him just once that day? Look, the first time I met Chief, I knew everything about him. It was like a transparent book. He told me everything about himself. He said he is into estate business that he has branches all over the world he has in the u.s in the uk in the ukraine you know lots of places in the world he's a very rich man his wealth is limitless and um, he's also a general merchandise with people working for him okay i feel a bit relieved knowing that the money i'm spending has nothing to do with fraud but uh, babe which man gives a woman one million naira just like that, Abi. We shine Congo, not at all. But even if he requests for it, who am I to say no? After all, there are other girls in my business line that are looking for this opportunity. We are like bosses. If I refuse him to enter my boss, there will always be another boss for him to catch. <laughs> Babes, anything that is dear to you, hold it tight, guide it with jealousy. This is serious. You know, I've been thinking. Thinking about what? For someone that gave us this huge gift, I think he deserves to be appreciated. Okay, how? What do you mean how? If somebody gives you something, you're not supposed to say thank you. Oh, is that what you mean? Okay, I, I thought you meant... Um appreciating him in kind even if he's in kind there's one million that are not worth it please 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 count me out of it not please stop getting unnecessarily tense i didn't mean the other way around i just meant we should appreciate him who knows i might recover everything that i lost that that idiot duped me from him 
don't be better but i would advise you forget about him and move on and okay that's fine if if, if it's just to go and say thank you to him with words i'm fine but me i can't sleep with that chief never mm. i can't do virgin mary as if say someone you know they shine your eh, 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 eh. don't bring my own samuel into this please, please. Fillion! Fillion! What is it? I just spoke to Chief Kayode and we rescheduled a meeting to meet with him over the weekend, you and I. Emilia, can you watch yourself talk? You resolved to see Chief with me and you didn't bother to tell me first. It doesn't change the fact that appreciation is necessary. Oh, this is the point. Sometimes just own up. If you don't want to go, it's fine by me. No, no, that's not it. At least you, you, you need to tell me first. But I already said I'm sorry for not letting you know. All right, we're supposed to thank this man. It's not like it's going to take the whole day. It's not even going to take your time. So why all these complaints? It's fine. I, I will think about it. <sighs> you didn't think about it. Emily, are you sure he will still come? Uh, uh, calm down, he will come. I just spoke to him on the phone. He said he's sending his driver down. Don't worry. He cannot disappoint me. But I still feel the appreciation should have been done over the phone other than going to that place. <laughs> God, Philian. It depends on the heaviness of the gift. You cannot compare someone that dashed you 5,000 naira to someone that dashed you 400,000 naira. She'll get size now. On a very good day, we're supposed to go to that man's house and lick his feet, prostrate before him. Ha, huh, Emilia, you have really sold your soul. I cannot believe you're saying that you will lick a man's feet because of money. That is what I'm talking about. It might not be small money, it's just for instance, that, like a gold. When a gold falls, you will know the stuff and quality that gold is made of. It gets some, if they fall, they go make zinc sound. Some go fall and make aluminium sound. Some can even make plastic sound. But this money entered into your account and sounded like thunder. So, Emilia, what, what's the point now? The point is, since that money entered into your account, I have been observing you. Your countenance has changed. Hey, you have not been... That's to show the, 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 the quality of the deposit of money that entered into your account. Uh, excuse me, please. Uh, who is Emilia? Me. You from Chief Kayode? Yes, he asked me to come and pick you up. Let's go. Thank you. Uh, excuse me, please. As a guest, you are supposed to be at the back. Oh, yeah. I get it. <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. Wow, this house is beautiful. Yes. This way, please.
Yeah, you're welcome. Let the stress come for me. Welcome to one of my exquisite homes, Emilia. <laughs> How are you? I'm fine, Chief. You're welcome. Chief, this is my sister, Filian. Filian, this is Chief Kayode, the man I told you gave. Oh, okay. Oh, thank you so much, sir, for your kind gesture. I mean, the money was huge. I'm, I'm really grateful. That was nothing. Please, sit. Thank you. Chidato. Sir. You may leave. Thank you, sir. I hope your trip to my house was not stressful. No, no, not at all, sir. You have a beautiful house. Oh, you're welcome. I have lots of drinks. I have Hennessy. I have Campari. Don Prayon. I have red wines and uh, cocktails. Um, sir, red, wa a... red wine will be fine, sir. It's all right. Um, Joe. Yes, sir. <laughs> Please get two bottles of red wine. Okay, sir. Emilia. Chief. Once again, you're welcome. Thank you. How are you? I'm fine. How are you? Very well, thank you. Okay. Nice to see you again. Same here. Yes, please. One bottle to each person. No, 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 sir. Two bottles. One bottle for you. Nothing is too much in my house. Even if you want some more, you can take back home. <laughs> Emilia. Yes. I'll be right back. Okay, Chief. <laughs> Yes. Just one bottle is fine. Is he complaining? I don't understand you. Emile, we're not here to drink. Just shut here. up your mouth. We're here to see if we can go home. Just give us. Was she embarrassed yourself everywhere you go? Say you're embarrassing me. Is he complaining? yourselves comfortable. Thank you. You're welcome. Amelia. Hello ladies. I hope you're having fun. Yes. Please, the dining is set. We'll be there shortly. When are we going home? Me, I'm already getting tired though. We know I've been. I'm sorry for keeping you ladies waiting. I was busy with something inside. Oh. All right, I'm here. Oh, sir, what's that stain on your clothes? Oh, 
Sorry. Um, I was assisting the boys to kill a goat that was meant to have been prepared before your arrival. Unfortunately, I just did it. Never mind. It's nothing. Um, tell me, what do you do for a living? Me? Yes. Okay, I work with a company that manufactures tires. It's called Jackie's Tires. Owned by Chief Jackson Melaye. Exactly. You, you know him, sir? Yes. He was my friend until the quest for survival set us apart. Everyone wants to succeed. Nothing is enough in this life. Oh. And you, my beautiful Emilia, what do you do? Oh, I'm sorry. You told me, but I have forgotten. I mean, to import and export, I deal with all kinds of jewelries. Wow. I am surrounded by beautiful, intelligent, business minded women. So you can say that again. Yeah, you're welcome. Um. Let's eat. Can someone lead us in the prayer? Okay, I'll just do that. In Jesus' name. Amen. Father, Lord, bless us with this gift which we are about to receive from your bounty. Through Christ our Lord Jesus. Amen. Um, from your prayers, I can tell which uh, faith you belong to. I used to be a knight. Used to? Oh, yes. I am still a knight, but run around won't let me practice you know um but i still pay my quarter to his vineyard that's good yes that's it Let's go home. Jeez. You must have slept for long. Oh. You ladies are awake already. You slept off after the meal. I equally did. I was waiting for them to prepare a place for you to retire. We have more than 20 rooms in this house. No, 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 sir. No, no, sir. We didn't plan on staying. Please, could you just ask your driver to take us home, please? I would have loved to. But after my last encounter, this place is secured. Somebody wanted to assassinate me, but God saved my life. Besides, it's three hours before dawn. So, relax and stay safe. It's, it's okay. We'll stay. Okay. Um, Joe! Joe! Yes, sir. I hope the guest room is neat. Yes, sir, it is. 
please take a fillion inside. A million. Yes, ma'am. This is where you'll be sleeping for the night. Everything you need is provided. Okay. Thank you very much. All right. Good night. Good night. It's me, Joe. Your sister sent me to you. I brought you a nice way. Yeah. Thank you. You're welcome. Hold on, I'm coming. Yes, um... Your sister... Watch uh, Arsenal Brentford. If I know what you're you for watch. You know what I'm doing? Hey, 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 hey! Help me, help me, please help me. Come on, help me. Help Come me. here. Help me, please. Somebody is after down, my calm life. Calm down, calm down. What happened? Someone is after my life. Who please is help after me. you? What happened? Calm down. Somebody is after my life. Please Hello. help me. It's okay, eh? Just relax. Relax, my guy. Let's see. I suspect that girl is one of Chief's victims. Hmm. You're right. It's true. Hmm. Um, you know what? Keep an eye on her. Okay? Make no any suspicious move. Hold on. Finish room. Chief is calling. Hello, Chief. Yes, sir. Um, she's here with us. Um, all right, sir. We'll do as you've said, sir. All right, sir. What, what did he say? That we should hold her time till he comes. Better. I hope this time we're going to get a better reward. I hope so. I hope so. She has escaped.
Did you see her? Did you see her? Oh. Omo. This girl can run. This girl now is in boat. Listen. Listen, man. Eh? I suggest you go back. Let's leave this because this girl might have run far. Let's go. Before we find this, put us into trouble. Trouble? Talking about trouble, we're already in one. How? How? How are we going to explain to Chief that we caught a girl he's looking for? All of a sudden, she escaped. No, you think he will take it lightly with us? Mr. Guy, we are not his boys, okay? He is not our boss. So, we are not under his payroll. Forget about him. Remember, Chief is very, very influential. He might come at us. Yes, I agree with you. He is capable of doing anything, but my guy, it's never our fault that he escaped. Ah. Let me suggest to you that we should search further because she pays very well. Remember how she did dash on? She will give us better money. Ah, ah. Even not for anything for that money, guy, we will search further. Guy, think, use your sense. Think of what will happen to us if the whole estate finds out that we are into illegal business. Eh? Anyone will catch your chief, now chief will. If you don't catch you, leave him. See, I'm back to the duty post. If you want to search, search. I'm off. Be like, say you're there, right? Be like, no, I'm, I'm, I'm left. I'm not right. Stay. No, 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 let me take this one. Are you sure this side is safe? Yeah. We lost her, sir. She escaped. What nonsense are you talking about? Eh? Sir, we never knew she escaped from you until you called. So we are talking to you over the phone. She, before, before we could turn around, she had disappeared. Are you fools? I believe she overheard our conversation with you, sir. You saw a girl moving Helda girl by that time of the night. Did you need an oracle to tell you that you escaped? From me. Usually, when you see a girl moving about at night, what do you usually do? Uh, Chief, we usually bring them to you. So, what happened about tonight's nice incident? We are sorry, sir. It's because we were on call. That's what I'm saying. Did I have to call you? We are sorry, sir. Thank you. Thank you, sir. You call copper business. Baby, what I don't know is why you have to do this. Just all in the name of money. I don't know what that means. Like, does it mean I don't give you enough money as your boyfriend? I said I'm sorry. Like I said, I, I, I didn't know who made the transfer. I, I, was, um, I was about going to the bank when Emilia told me that she initiated the transfer through Chief Coyote. I, I didn't ask for it. You were even told that Chief initiated the transfer. Now when you decided to go and give appreciation, why didn't you tell me? At least so that I can go with you for your safety. Or you may decide to just put the call across instead of going there in person. Yes, I suggested that, but Emilia told me to be disrespectful, to oh, say no. thank you to a man who gave me such amount of money over the phone. Come on, Sammy. You and I know certainly this is not the right time to start apportioning blames. Uh, did you say your friend suggested you go see him on one-on-one? -on -one? Yes. Then she has a case to answer. I strongly believe she probably knows something about your attempted murder. She could be part of those working for Chief Coyote. That's not true, officer. It's not true. You have I don't think so. How do you mean? 
If she was part of this, she wouldn't have sent me a text to escape from that room. Listen to me, young lady. As an inspector with an experience, your friend probably might have given you out already before she decided to have a change of heart. It was already too late, as it stands right now. What if they get to know that she gave you a tip that made you escape? Her life definitely will be in danger right now as we speak. You know, but it's not true. I don't think so. Why then would somebody pay such an amount of money into your account without even telling you in the first place? Chief Cowardy wasn't even bothered about your appreciation. And yet it was your friend who suggested you go see him to thank him for what he has done for you. Um, Chicky, what are you actually implying? Does that mean Emilia schemed Filian's death? Exactly, Sammy. That's exactly what I'm saying. So how possible is that? Look at it this way, Sammy. The money transferred here is so huge, which makes one-on-one -on -one appreciation unavoidable. Look, see, oh, Officer Chucky, I know you're making a lot of sense here, but please, let's just save my friend. Let us save Emilia, please. Come on. You and I know in the cost of investigation, pragmatic measures should be carefully adopted. A sleep in the course of this investigation is going to cost us a lot of damages. What if the girl in question has given her allegiance to Chief Coyote? And you and I know Chief Coyote is an influential person. We'll all be doomed. Baby, you are so worried. Please, can you just sit down? How can I sit when my friend is out there in a lion's den? But the police are already in action. Can you just allow them to do their work? For how long? For how long? Just stop to Chucky to do his job. Or are they planning on rescuing a dead girl? Please, don't say that. Okay, what if what the inspector said is true? If Emilia pledged her allegiance to Chucky? That's not possible. It's it's not possible. The Emilia I know would do no such thing. Yes, I know she loves money, but Emilia would never betray me. Can you listen to yourself? I mean, can you just listen to yourself talk? You don't have to say it in like this. Oh, okay, it's fine, but just just uh, tell Chucky to hasten up. I don't know what he's doing. Please allow this people to carry out their assignment. That is their duty. Okay, thank God you're even aware that she's in love with money. Okay, it's fine, it's fine, baby, but just talk to Chucky to hasten up. I, 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 I miss my friend. The best you can do for me right now is to allow these people to do their work. Okay? Okay, okay. I'm ready. Just, just do something. I, I, I can't stay in this house all alone. I, I, I miss Emilia. I miss her. I pray you don't get shot, okay? And I pray you don't get shot if what the inspector said is true. It's not true. It, can, it can't be true. It can't be my own Emilia. Emilia would do no such thing. I pray, Camille. Oh, God. That's okay. Please, Dad, please come in. Inspector Chuki. Welcome, sir. Yeah, Mr. Sir. You're welcome. How are you? I'm fine. Welcome, sir. Please come and see. Thank you. Sir, so, what do I offer you? Oh, no, I'm good. You Thank sure? you. Yeah, I'm okay. Sammy, you know humans are capable of doing anything for money. Absolutely. If a man can use his mother who gave birth to him for money ritual, what else can a friend not do here? <laughs> no. Officer, I, I refuse to accept that as a fact. It is certainly not a fact until investigation is concluded. When, officer? When? I feel my life is in danger. Oftentimes, I see weird-looking men all around, and they look so strange. 
<laughs> I can understand how you feel, Philia. You see, in the course of our investigation, there are certain things you don't make public, especially to people who are not in our field. There are things that are meant to be kept secret. Those men you see patrolling around are policemen, and they are here to keep you safe. Really? Yes. Oh, thank you so much. At least I feel a bit better now. Um, Chuki, I must say a very big thank you to you for all you are doing. But um, I want to ask, when is this whole thing going to be over? Very soon. When I mean very soon, I mean pretty soon. The good news here is this, honey. We have been given a warrant to search and question Chief Coyote. Impressive. That is a good one and a smart move at that. But the bad news here is also this. If anything goes wrong, I mean, if anything ever goes wrong in the course of this investigation, we are doomed. When I mean doomed, we are doomed for life. <sighs> Lord, please help me. I'm doing all of this because you are my very good friend. Ordinarily, I wouldn't do this if I'm not too sure of the suspect. You and I know how influential Chief Coyote is. And Philia doesn't even have enough evidence to nail him for what he has been accused of. But even at that, I'm sticking my neck into it. And I appreciate all that you are doing. You're welcome. Sincerely speaking, I appreciate. And um, trust me, I will not stop appreciating you for all the efforts you are making. Well, Sonny, I want to rightly point out this to you. If there's anything you could still remember in the course of this investigation, please do not hesitate to let me know. Absolutely. Yes, this will. Yeah. Thank you, officer. Absolutely. Yeah, good day to you. May I help you, sir? We are here to see Chief. Chief, is he aware you're coming? Not at all, but he will be glad to receive us. Oh, okay. I'm going to go That's all right. Some Let are... them in. They are here on a custody visit. They told you, right? Yes, so, let them in. Yes, Emily, are you okay? Yes. You're not drinking? I'll drink later. Sam. Dr. Chiefs. Yes, please. Uh, please, is there any lead? Uh, I just spoke with a security man now. He has gone in to notify him. Oh. So let's just wait till he comes out. Okay. Uh, that's good. Uh, you may come in. Oh, good.
good day, Chief. I am Inspector Danny. Oh, Inspector. Please, sit down. Oh, thank you. I'm good standing. Emilia, so it's true. So it's true you planned all this and wanted me killed. You sent me a message. But I didn't send you any message. What are you talking about? I was surprised when I looked for you the next day. You were already gone. I don't know what you're talking about. What do you, what do you mean you didn't send me any message? What is going on here? Okay, if you did not see me, why didn't you search for me everywhere? Can someone tell me what is going on here? Yes. Tell us what's going on here. Why are you people here? Yeah, I'm sorry, Chief. I show no disrespect. Um, I think there's a mix of someone. I will fix it. We only came here on the court to visit you. And as it stands now, I think these two ladies actually have something to fix on their own. Probably you thought something was wrong. But whosoever that gave you any information about me must have misinformed you and next time before you make a move verify because i know that you are not here on the course of visit you are very right chief i'm sorry like i said i mean no disrespect uh, we'll be taking our leave immediately have a good day i will chief Nice one, Emilia. Nice one. I'm sorry, baby. I should have listened to you when you speculated about um, Emilia's allegiance to Chief. I'm sorry. It's okay. I'm glad this whole thing is playing out right before your presence. Next time, you need to listen, okay? Yes, um, Inspector Chiggs. Yes, Sonny. I'm sorry for all we have put you through. Mm. I know how difficult this must have been. It would have cost you a whole lot. Oh, certainly it wouldn't cost me anything. I didn't actually give him my real ID. Mm. You know, Filian was very right. That man is evil. How, how could you? Didn't you see how free Emilia was talking to all of us? I mean, was there any sign of danger or kidnap in all what she said? Sammy, I want you to understand one thing. You know, as an expert in criminal cases, she was pretending at the same time she was acting free under duress. As a matter of fact, while we were busy talking to them, I noticed Chief Right Hand was talking behind Emilia. That's exactly where the control lies. And what the control seems to be is what I can really figure out. And don't you think that could be a gun? Oh, even a knife. Oh, come on. Whatever it is, we are going to disarm them. Uh, you know, she was talking to us and at the same time, she was trying to pass a message. Mm -hmm. And I could see fear written all over her when I mentioned we were leaving. This is your department. As an investigative officer, I trust what you can do. Please, go ahead. There's no problem. Officers? Sir! I need you to be on alert. Yes, sir. Again? I'm sorry, Chief. We have a warrant to search this property. Search my house for what? Order from above, Chief. Order from above? Yes. <laughs> Are you aware that the commissioner is my friend? You're free to put a call through to him. <laughs> Officer. Stop. Search the home, please. Okay, sir. Everyone. Yes, sir. I can see that you have made up your mind to quit your job. Stop. 
we find the cops in this house. A girl. He's one of the captives. Is, is it nonsense? Know where you're going, officer. Know where you're going. Young man, calm down. Alright, sir. It's okay, you're safe. Calm down. Calm down, young man. That's okay, you're safe. Call the ambulance officer. Okay, sir. And do that right away. All right, sir. Chucky, my man. That's okay. That's all right. You're a great <laughs> man. You're under arrest for attempted murder. Anything you say or do shall be used against you at the court of law. Now move. My friend, move. I'll shoot your legs. My friend, move. Enter the car. My friend, enter the car. Shut up. Enter the car. Enter the car. Enter the car. Emilia, can you please tell us what you saw? After Fillion left, I went in with Chief. So he swore. Where are you going? I... I want to make use of the restroom. Sorry. The one here is not in good order. You can take the corridor, the blast door by your left hand side. Are you okay? Oh, yes, I'm fine. What was that? I don't think that was just a male organ. 
I have never seen something like this, nor felt something like this before. Who is that? Who, 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 who are you? Are you, are you also a captain here? Who, who are you? Who are you? Uh, uh, please, can you, can you help me take off the blind? So I can at least see who I am talking to. Please. Help me with mine. Please. Please. For goodness. For goodness, thank you, thank you, thank you. You? What are you doing here? What are you doing here? What are you doing here? I... I came with my girlfriend. I. Where is she? She's still alive because no one who walks in here gets out alive. Where is your friend? I don't know. I don't know if she's alive or dead. How did you get here? Some armed men kidnapped me. I thought you said. Maybe I am a victim of circumstance. Probably I'm paying the price for how I treated you. you to my deity. You had the guts to scam me. No money leaves me for anyone without a price. Ask if we are 
Whatever happens thereafter, I don't know because I can't stop. From observations, what you tend to be manhood wasn't manhood. He made love to you with its snake. Snake? My snake. You see, I have followed up such cases in the past before. And from what she narrated, they seem to be in the same court with my previous suspect. You say he slept with you. Boy, I don't understand. You need to seek for urgent medical and spiritual attention. My goodness. How you came about this whole thing, it's, it's frightening. This is more serious than I thought, Chuki. The case of the previous girl did not end well. God forbid, nothing will happen to Amelia. You see, all that glitters are not good. People appear to be very sociable on social media. But their aim is not what you think. And that's the main reason why we have to be extremely mindful of the kind of people we, we visit. We need to get to know them very well. Else, the intention towards us sometimes is so bad. Chucky, you have said nothing but absolute truth. Thank you very much. You're welcome, Sammy. It's me, Fabian. Oh, hi. Hi. How are you girls doing? We're good. You? What is it? Why she called him in? Why are you crying? She has been like this since yesterday. She's scared of what will happen to her according to what the inspector said. Nothing. Nothing will happen to you. Yes, ma'am. Brave up. Go upstairs and prepare. To where? I have an uncle who is very good at this spiritual things. I'm, I'm sure he'll be able to reverse whatever it is. Yes, ma'am. We need to go. We don't have any choice. Trust me. Yes. Come, come. Get ready. Fabian, I want to use this opportunity to thank you for standing by me despite all odds. Oh, come on. God of everything, I mean, thank God. Uh, the most important thing is that you are fine, I mean, you're confirmed safe and you're okay. I really don't know how to thank you for all your kind gestures. You were able to provide all the things needed for my cure without excitation. Human life is very precious, if not the most precious thing. Human life 
everything goes. Thank you so much. Thank you once again. Oh, that reminds me. Can I take you out somewhere we could have a cup of coffee? Whenever you're ready, I'll be there. Thank you. So can I see you after the gate? Bye. I would like to have a word with you. I'm here. Please sit. Okay. Fillion, I would like to dust up my certificate and put it to use. The job vacancy you spoke to me about the other time, is it still available? I want to work. Oh, man. This is so good to hear. Well, I don't know. Uh, you know you didn't show interest, so I didn't know how it went. But then I'll call our general manager and then get back to you. Thank you. I really want to work. No, it's fine, babe. You've taken the right step. Mm? Even if the position has been taken, there must be a way to squeeze you in. Mm? All you need to do is get your application and your resume ready. I'm so happy to hear this. Now, this is the Amelia I used to know. So we can both wear skirts and t-shirts. I, I recommend you read this book. Is this the book that changed your life? <laughs> Not necessarily, but it's talking about secrets of success. I think you will need it. So, of course, I'll read it. The way you were standing on the phone, you were standing as someone who was expecting me to say something, but at the same time, you weren't expecting me to say yes. You have been so skeptical about the whole thing. What could that be? It's, it's about Amelia. What about her? I don't know, but it's it seems I'm falling in love with her. Then what are you waiting for? Do your team, man. Your meeting. Everything that transpired seems to be an act of God. So, go for her. But I think she's now taking my space as your best friend. Hey, 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 hey. Well, go if there is not possible for her to take your place. My G for life, and I'm talking about the life part that I am. I just can't seem to take her off my head. Go for her. Do your thing, my man. And if there's any need for a best man, I'll consider you. <laughs> <laughs> you can say it again. Cheers to long life. <laughs> More money. <laughs> Oh, baby. 
<laughs> Thank you. So, a little gathering has suddenly become an engagement party. Of course, who else will be the best you. man? You. <laughs>